If you guys want to be in with a chance of winning a huge host of prizes in my Christmas giveaway, including thief points, coins, and even a football shirt of your choice, all you need to do is leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below, and subscribe to my channel if you're new around here. Best of luck and enjoy the video. Hey guys, it's Way here. Welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be showing you how to complete the brand new footmost Emiliano Regioni SBC, the cheapest and easiest way. As of right now, this will save you back around 50,000 coins on both consoles, and in return, you get yourself this 82 rated card with 5 star weak foot and 4 star skill moves, 94 pace. 83 dribbling, 79 shooting and 80 passing as the standard attributes and yes it is a decent card but to be brutally honest I have no idea why you do this SBC because you can get someone like Quadrado who's got a virtually identical card as well as also having 5 star skill moves and he's literally like 5k and tradable. We also had Footmas Callahan yesterday, he is in the exact same posi position in the same league, literally like EA what is the point of doing these types of SBCs, 50k for a card that would be like 12k in the team of the week when we already had a Serie A right mid yesterday it just doesn't make sense but anyway let's go on into it if you guys are for some reason planning on doing the SBC I'll show you how to do it the cheapest way so you need two players from the Serie A at least one Argentine player a maximum of four players from the same nation an 84 rating and 90 chemistry the easiest way of doing this is to just build a full Serie A team as it allows you to use quite a few players out of position and save yourself coins now to get an 84 rating I'd recommend using the same formula that I've used right here and that is two 85 rated guys I've gone with Manalas and and Mirandi, you could go with someone like Skriniar if you wanted, or Ed and Dzeko, you've got a few options. You don't need to use the same players as me, just use players with the same rating. Then I've got quite a few 84s, Chesney, Perrin, Gomez, Mandzukic and Quadrado. So a total of five. Uh, I've gone with Gomez as my Argentine player, I'd recommend to you guys to do the same. You do also have people like Pastore um, and Biglia that you could also use as well if you wanted, but they're the ones I used. And you can use a goalkeeper completely out of position here, which is what I've done. Uh, it doesn't have to be the same ones I've used. You could maybe use someone like Pepe Reina there, for example, as your 83, and then use an 84 somewhere else. Uh, then you need to go and get yourself um, two 81s, and I believe that is it. Yeah, two 81s will finish off, so I've got High Serge in here. And then I've got Perotti right here as well. The reason I went with this formula is because there aren't really any high rated fullbacks in this area that aren't super expensive. Uh, and it's the same with left sided midfielders. So by doing this I was able to use two 81s and they fit in. And I managed to get the 90 chemistry by then using uh, a player completely out of position there. So it worked out quite well. Uh, just to check, I do actually have loyalty chemistry on two of these players, so if you copy me exactly and haven't position changed anyone, this won't work, but all you need to do is literally to make Quadrado a right winger, or Lucas Leiva, or De Rossi a centre mid, or Gomez a cam, any of those things, and you'll get to the 90 chemistry you require. Um, so that's it really, just like you need one Argentine player, that's the only real requirement here that you need to follow, apart from making sure you don't have more than uh, four players from the same nation, uh, but very, very easy to do. Very, very affordable. Well, I, I, like, it's not very cheap. It's like 50k, which is quite cheap for a footmas SPC, but for the card you're getting, it's not cheap. Like, that card would literally be worth like 12 to 15k if you were in the team of the week. Um, so I personally just wouldn't recommend doing the SBC. Like maybe if you've done Alejandro Gomez uh, and you want a player to get a hype link to him, then you could go with Rajoni. But that's like literally the only reason I can think of, unless you're a big fan of is it Atlanta that he plays for? I think it is. Or a big fan of him in real life. Like, literally look at Quadrado's stats. Look at look at his stats. He's got 91 pace. He's got pretty similar, like, just pretty similar stats across the board, really. He's quick. He's got very similar shooting, passing, and dribbling. And he's got five-star skills. And if you look on the market, he is, like, what, 7K? And that's because he's being used in this SBC. Normally, he's, like, 4 or 5K. Like, and he's tradable as well. And plays for Juventus, so it's easier to link. Like, I don't know why you'd get this card. He's 82 rated and 50K. It's the same like with that um, Akanji SBC yesterday where it was 100k for an 82 rated player. Like some of these requirements are just retarded by EA. Like honestly I don't know why they pick some of these players uh, or some of their positions as well. Like Son is a left winger. We have literally like 15 usable left wingers from the Premier League. We had Rashford already like not long ago. We've got Sterling at the moment. Like there's no need for more wingers. Just make him a striker and people would be happy but like they pick the right players sometimes, not not in this case, but they, they either give them like the wrong position, the wrong chemistry, the wrong rating, like too high requirements. Like I, d I don't know what's going on. But anyway, this is how you do the SBC cheaply. Went off on one a bit there. But anyway, if you guys did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe if you're on your own here. Let me know down below if for some reason you've done this SBC. And I'll catch you guys later. Take care.